Hello and welcome. In this video segment, I'm going to show you how to replace these wore out headlight lens on a Ford Crown Vet. If you're not a subscriber, just hit that button become a subscriber right away. So let's begin. Well, first thing we're going to do, we're going to open up the hood. Now what we're going to do, we're going to unscrew this panel here. And we have some screws right here. And you can see it says unlock. Turn them 45 degrees. And we have one over here by the battery. And what we're going to do is just lift up on it. These are the tools I'm going to be using in the video. Um, normally, uh, you may see instructions that say all you need is a, a flathead screwdriver. Of course, I'm going to use that, but I'm going to use some. I'm going to use this prior bar here too, with a little hook on it. Uh, five thirty second socket with a quarter inch ratchet, a punch, light hammer, a pair of pliers. Now you don't have to use all these items. But I just want you to see what I'ma have in the video. I'm gonna start on the driver's side. Right, we're gonna put a rag right here. Take a screwdriver, put right here. Just pry it out. Just take your time. There we go. Pull up on it. Pull that out of the way. Now over here. We're just gonna take a screwdriver and just use this corner right here. Now what we'll do, we'll just push the headlight out. And what we wanna do is just disconnect. Guys, don't be surprised, your clips break. And that can very well happen. Your lights will still work as far as the headlight. Let's just unscrew it here. Just wiggle it back and forth. Now a new headlight assembly comes with a new headlight. Just gonna pull it out of the way. We have our old headlight. And this is our new headlight. What a bit difference. And the new headlight actually come with the new bulbs, new turn signal. And that's one less thing you have to worry about in the future. Say before you put in your new headlight, make sure you actually measure your old headlights, the distance in your gap here. You want to make your, your new headlights the same. And also, the new headlight comes with a new lock cap for the, uh, the headlight bulb. Just press it in. Not going anywhere. So again, you want to have the same adjustments as we have here and here. So I'm just going to screw it out until it looks pretty much like the old one. Maybe able to screw it with your finger. Now I can. Before I couldn't. Just slide it as far back as you can. Alright, we're gonna slide this clip in. We're just gonna press it down. We got that one lined up and we're gonna put this one in. So once you get both of them lined up, Guys, it's gonna be a little tight. So I just take a hammer and a punch and just tap it lightly. We have this side down. And you can always take a pry bar here, put it right here up against this screw. And the back end here. Just pry down on it. There we go. Finish the driver side. Now we'll go over to the passenger side. We're just gonna pry it out, pull it up. 
There we go. Just take your time. Okay. You may or may not have some clips you have to remove. This is for the uh, the running light, the turn signal. Just want to remove this one. We'll just take your time. We just want to remove our headlight bulb. Here's our new one with the part number and the price. Now again, you wanna make sure you have the same clearance that you have on your new one that you had on your old one. Slide it back in the hole. Just make sure that you can actually see the line here. And we can put our clips back in place on both sides. Just press that. Just hold on your head right. In case it's just a little bit aggravating, just put a punch right here. And we're just gonna tap it down lightly. So that's what you want. And it can be a little tight, so just have patience. And then we're going to put this, this one in here. We just have one to deal with. Make sure we have it in the groove. And we just want to press down. Make sure your head line. And what you want to do, you want to make sure that both your clips are flush with the base here. And that way you know you actually have them down all the way. You want to place back the panel. Lock it down. Let's see what we have. Now you can purchase these headlights as a kit with the side lens, but uh, I didn't see anything wrong with the side lens. And you just want to make sure your single lights working. Well, that's all it takes to change out those dull headlight lands. And just in time, too, because now it's dark. <laughs> Hopefully this video was helpful. Do not forget to subscribe. And on the next video, what I'm going to do is show you how to adjust the headlights on a Crown Vet. So if you need to adjust your headlights, make sure you see that video. I'm going to walk you through it step by step. And hope that video will be helpful also. Do not forget to subscribe. Take care. And God bless.